Hello everyone, welcome, 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 welcome to yet another Trackmania cast. I'm uh, Nelki and I'm here to bring you uh, the loser bracket match between Mr. Monkeys and Bad Boys. Seems uh, still are waiting for Team Bad Boys. Match uh, was planned to start at 8 but uh, it's, it's already 1 past 8 and uh, they are not here yet so uh, we have a little bit of delay at the moment. Let me uh, put this on busy. Alright, it's already on busy. That's, uh, so uh, let's go through the things that happened last week. Let's go through the winner bracket first so we can see what happened last week. So last week we saw um, uh, Mysterious Monkeys losing versus A New Era with a 7-2 with a, with a score in the end. So it was a uh, pretty close match actually. It, it was a kind of a surprise uh, if I have to be honest. I uh, did not expect A New Era to win against against mysterious monkeys but uh, it still happened we also see that uh, against authority is playing against expert orange that uh, is gonna be an amazing 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 match as well i don't know if there are any any streams of them i think they are and here we see uh, bad boys joining actually i hate on my uh, on my main screen here but, um, let's go to the loser bracket where uh, we are playing so uh, we see that uh, mcon has already defeated team insects with a 9-0 score, so they are already through to the next round in the loser bracket. Mysterious Monkeys will now play against Bad Boys. Uh, the match that will happen right now. You have Easy Esports versus Access Esports. And then we have Lie and Cost versus Eminem Gaming 2. So a uh, pretty, pretty nice loser bracket as well. So uh, let's see what match, what kind of match uh, that tonight will bring us. I'm very curious to see. Uh, how bad boys will perform tonight haven't seen them in quite a while actually so uh, it's gonna be new for me as well I thought they uh, I thought they were not playing anymore but now it seems they are back hopefully uh, they will stay in the scene for a very very long time but uh, let's take a look at the first map I think uh, this map will be played first let's see let's take a look at the records on this map take a look at the Dedimania. We see that Texter is at second with a 101.668. And uh, we see that Severn is at 17th with a 101.785. Harney at 27th with a 101.821. And Shark at, at, at 28th, just one place behind Harney with a 101.825. Only four thousandths of a second between those two records. So uh, let's go through the players for uh, for for both teams. For Mysterious Monkeys, of course, we have the same lineup as the pre as the previous matches. We have Shark, Harney, Kensili, Default, Marco, Bits, Severn, and Dexter. For Bad Boys, we have Ziggy, Fro, PML, Tommy D, and Gimme. Um, uh, I know Ziggy. I have seen him play. In the past as well, it's a pretty, uh, pretty damn good player. Tommy D as well. Uh, the the other players of Bad Boys I'm not really known with, but uh, don't think that's a problem at all. So, uh, so yeah, let's wait for the warmups to be over on this map. Uh, Cozy made by Sparko and Buzzy. I think this is gonna be the map uh, that will be played the one if you want on. Yo, dude, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Appreciate y'all tuning in tonight. So uh, let's take a little overview of the map here as we are waiting for the last warm up to finish. That's what I uh, always do, of course. Eddie by Watson. Eddie and Watson, sorry. <laughs> let's search for the exit sign. Here is the exit sign. There we go. We, we already found it. The exit sign, of course, the name of the championship. The exit the struck media championship, of course. Let's take a overview from above. There we go. That's what the map, what the map looks like from above. But here we go. The match is about to start. Let me put my uh, Twitch link in real quick. There we go. Joe HF to all the players, and uh, we're gonna start the one v one. Mysterious monkeys versus bad boys. A little bit of a delay here. Six minutes delay, but uh, it's not. Uh, it's not. It's not hurting too much. I think it's gonna be. Dexter versus BML. So uh, let's see what this one for one will bring us on 
Cozy made by Sparko and Busy. Following BML for the first round, here we go. 1v1, Bad Boys or Mysterious Monkeys versus Bad Boys. Loser brackets. Here we go. See that uh, Dexter is a, a little bit of a lead here in the start. BML is just behind. He is going for the inside line, so he will start to get closer a little bit. So it seems like he's not. He's, he's doing the stairs not as fast as Dexter is at the moment. Oh, then he clips the wall. He's lagging as well a little bit, though. So, uh, oh, he gets a no drift. So let's switch to Dexter here just to see if he can make any kind of mistake. Or uh, if he uh, can save the round and take the first round for his team in the, in the one if you want. See the last couple of turns coming up here. The left hander here, and then uh, after this, the 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 wall up to the right. And then uh, the jump in the thing. He he is taking it very very safe. And so here we go. First point will go to mysterious monkeys. So uh, Dexter also played the 1v1 in last week versus Dutchy, I think. And uh, he also won that with a 7-4 score, if I'm correct. So uh, let's see if he can do it once again against the BML from Bad Boys. Let's, uh, let's switch to Dexter here. Let's see, uh, now he's a little bit behind BML. It's the other way around. He's going for the inside line as well right now. So it's kind of a... Uh, it's like exactly the other way around of the previous round. Uh, BML tries to stay in the lead, but uh, Dexter with an insane amount of speed coming back very nicely. He is going for the wide speed as well. Up on the road here, the left hander coming up through the poles. He's overtaking BML. He's going for the for the more inside line here. Uh, it's it seemed to pay off all, but he had to release a little bit in order to not clip the wall. Uh, he's falling a little bit behind Dexter. Coming up to the last couple of turns, BML uh, has to risk it if he wants to catch up to Dexter, and he is, but then he gets a little bit of a Ramstein from the border, loses a little bit of speed, and this round again will go to Mysterious Monkey's Dexter. Yo guys, appreciate y'all tuning in tonight. So 2-0 uh, right now for Mysterious Monkeys Dexters. My mode Dexter. Can he uh, can he build an even bigger lead over Bad Boys BML? It seems like uh, Dexter is not having the the greatest start. Once again, they are both going for the wider line, so uh, the distance will kind of stay the same. He's going for the inside line here, but will not have as much speed as BML. BML clipping the pole straight into the pole. So uh, another unfortunate mistake for BML. Same as in the first round. Seems like uh, once again, Mr. Smokies will have a, another, another clean, nice round to take uh, the third point. And uh, they will go up to a 3-0 score. Let's see if... Uh, Dexter can save the round. I'm, uh, I'm sure he will. I'm sure he can. Here we go. One last jump into the finish. And he will take first once again. 3-0 for Mysterious Monkeys. I really like the ending of this map. Like the really like the jump in into the finish. It's pretty cool. I really like those kind of finishes. Into uh, round number 4. Specking BML for bad boys. Yeah, he, uh, he is behind right now with 3-0 behind Mr. Smokey's Dexter. Uh, he needs to step up his game. He just strictly needs needs to drive faster if he wants to get a point. And look at the speed of BML. Damn, that was insane. Seems like they are pretty much equal right now. Dexter with a wider line had to release just a little bit. In order not to hit the wall there. Oh, not the best line of him as well. Not the best exit. He's going for the more inside line here. But BML will have more speed. And then Dexter clipping the pole. Unnecessary. That was really unnecessary though. In my opinion. That was uh, a kind of a uh, a major mistake by Mimo's Dexter. You don't see that happen too often. To uh, You don't see that happen too often. To Dexter that he uh, makes such a simple mistake 
But uh, this means they, uh, this will be around for bad boys. So they will get on the scoreboard. The bad boys score the points. And they are now up on the scoreboard. But it's still a 3-1 score for Mysterious Monkeys. Let's see if BML can bring this back. Make it a pretty close 1v1. One one. It is still a pretty close 1v1 one one, of course. Anything can still happen. Now it seems like uh, BML is falling a little bit behind in the start. More of, an, uh, more of an outside line. Tried to build up more speed than Dexter. But uh, it seems to not really pay off. Going very inside. But uh, the distance between those two players seems to stay equal. Dexter uh, still in the lead. Going up in the road. Approaching the poles. No mistakes from both players in this section. BML is coming closer, but then gets the no drifts. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate once again for BML. It's, uh, because of that no drift. Mysterious Monkeys will have another easy round. Those no drifts are very unfortunate for BML. And a pretty nice time as well for Dexter. A 101.00. A pretty good time. Pretty good match time. So uh, Dexter is up to a 4-1 score. Let's see if he can make his lead even bigger. Let's see if he can do it or uh, will BML come back from this. It seems like uh, BML just has to set faster times than he is... Then he's doing right now, and then he clips the wall on the left. Risked it too much, and uh, he falls behind already with a lot. Already with uh, with almost half a second. I think it will be even more in the next checkpoint. Uh, no, not really. It's still just about the same time difference. Uh, it seems like he's getting a little bit closer to Dexter, though. He's, he, he's trying to do the turn as, as fast as possible, of course, every turn. He's trying to do as fast as possible, but it seems like Mr. Smokey's Dexter will stay in the lead. Oh, BML losing his grip there a little bit. Uh, he is coming closer to Dexter, but is it enough? I don't think so. Last jump into the finish, and this round will also go to Dexter. So a 5-1 score for Mr. Monkeys. Bad boys uh, really have to uh, have to start driving faster. Just simply drive faster and make less mistakes. If it goes on like this, then it will be an easy one v one for Dexter. And the start uh, is about equal this time. No crashes in the start. Uh, it seems like BML will have a little bit more speed here. He's going wider. Uh, from not the best line. Well, he is overtaking Dexter. He is overtaking Dexter. I take my words back. That's a pretty good line. The, oh, the transition bug for BML. He is so unlucky in this 1v1. So unfortunate. He, he must be furious right now. All those no drifts. And now a transition bug there. In the, exactly the same section. Oh, that's so unfortunate for 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 bad boys. That's not good at all. It seems like uh, this round will again go to Mysterious Monkeys because of a uh, mistake of bad boys. So it's gonna be map point right now for for Mysterious Monkeys Dexter in the one v one. Very unfortunate transition. For VML in the last round. But uh, those things happen. But, uh, of course, it's it's not fun to see that. You just want to see and as close as one if you want as, as possible, of course. With as less mistakes as possible. It seems like uh, BML once again is behind in the start. But uh, his middle part, I think, is a little bit faster than uh, than. Dexter's middle part. Seems like uh, the distance stays about equal. Oh, now BML is coming closer. Yes, this turn once again. He is he is 
hearing that turn extremely good. This is uh, the, the closest round we've seen so far. This round can still go either way. Will BML uh, longer this 1v1? Or will Dexter finish it? BML overtaking Dexter in the end. Will Dexter come back from this? BML with a more outside line. Will have more speed. And this round will go to BML. Oh man, a 102.03 for BML. And a 101, uh, and a 102.7 for Dexter. That was the closest round we've seen so far. So the previous round will go to Bad Boys. They are not out of this one if you won yet, but uh, it it will be, and a very difficult job for BML to come back from this from this need of Dexter. But as I say that, Dexter makes a ton of mistakes. So uh, this seems to be a very easy round for BML. Oh, he had to release there a little bit though. Uh, he's, uh, he still has to survive through the entire map. Of course, uh, we've seen some no drift. We've seen some transition bugs for BML. Very unfortunate. He's, uh, he is driving it very safe. But uh, he is staying in front of a Dexter. I think... Uh, Dexter has to save his focus for the upcoming rounds to uh, to finish off this 1v1. Still a pretty nice match time for BML coming up here. Coming around a 101, a 102.03. A pretty good time still. Uh, a pretty easy round for BML. Uh, Dexter will finish with a 106.7, four and a half seconds behind BML. Uh, not a good time at all. Of course, uh, he made a lot of mistakes in in the start of the previous round. Into uh, round number 10. The 10th round. Oh, BML uh, seems to have a better start than Dexter this time as well. Uh, maybe uh, the pressure will start to rise up on the side of Dexter. And it seems like he is behind BML still. Oh, little Ramstein back will lose a little bit of speed here. Dexter will come back very strongly. Look at this. What a strong comeback from Dexter. Oh, but that BML in a nice couple of turns once again. Bringing it. Oh, bringing it back, I wanted to say. But then uh, he clips the wall on the left. And uh, I think this will be it for BML. Made one mistake and he's out of it. Let's go to Dexter if he, uh, to see if he makes a mistake, but uh, I don't think that will happen. He goes very safely th through the last couple of rounds, and BML even retires, and this 1v1 will go to Mysterious Monkeys. With a 7-3 score, Mysterious Monkeys, Dexter will win over Bad Boys BML in the 1v1. Let's move on to the 2v2 right now. Yeah, it was a uh, a pretty good one for one, I think. Some uh, unfortunate uh, unfortunate mistakes from uh, both of the team sides, but uh, yeah, it was a, a pretty decent one for one, in my opinion. It was not not the best one for one, but uh, it was a pretty decent one. So let's move on to map number two, artificial intelligence. I don't think I streamed this uh, this this map actually so uh, I think this one is new to the to to my casts uh, of the playoffs I think uh, Mr. Smokers haven't played this one in the playoffs so uh, let's take a look at the world record here Seems that Dexter has the world record here with a 58.682 we see seven from mysterious monkeys at fifth with a 58.728 and we see Harney at 13th with a uh, with a 58.837 and then we see Fro or I don't know how to pronounce it I just call him Fro with a 58.852 and then we see Tommy D for Bad Boys as well at 25th with a 58.885 As the players are doing some warm-ups, let's take a look at the lineups of both teams for this for this matchup for the 2v2. 
We see for bad boys. We see four players as well as for mysterious monkeys. Let's go through the bad boys players first. We have Olas, Fro, Jimmy, and Tommy D. And for mysterious monkeys, we have Harney, uh, Angelo, Bits, and Dexter. So uh, still uh, four players will have to will have to leave the lineup for for these for these teams. So uh, let's take a look at the map. Let's follow Harney through the map. Is there already our hall through, through through the map? I'm not very known on this map. As uh, this is the first time it will be in my cast for the for the for the playoffs. If I'm correct, at least. I think I am. But this is already the end. Uh, uh, let's switch to Olas here as he uh, Jumps into the finish. Another jump finish. I like those kind of finishes. Really uh, like them. It's a pretty. Uh, I think you can save a lot on the finish as well. If you jump as much as possible into the left corner of the finish, you will save a few hundreds again. So uh, I think one more warm up and then uh, the matchup, the 2v2, will start. Mr. Smokies won the first. Uh, won the first map. D1v1 with a 7-3 score. So they are in the lead right now with a 1-0 score. D1v1 and both D2v2 will count as one point. Um, the D3v3 and the 4v4 will count as two points. And then the 5v5 will count as three points. If uh, a team already won with a 6-0 score, the 5v5 will not have to be played. Uh, if not, the 5v5 will be played. Otherwise, it's uh, if if a team is already in the lead with a 6-0 score, the 5v5 will be unnecessary. Um, the admins changed this um, because the matches were th taking very, very long. And so all the sub matches had to be played. Even though, even though a team wasn't able to lose anymore but here we go two warm-ups are over glhf to all the players bad boys versus mysterious monkeys the 2v2 the one one is won by mysterious monkeys with a seven with a seven three score and and are now in the league with a one zero score so let's go the 2v2 on artificial intelligence made by alex the first time i will Cover this map for you. Here we go. It is gonna be Oles and Jimmy versus Bits and Angelo. Let's follow Oles in the first round. I like this. I really like the start of the map. It's pretty tight. And the first drift is pretty tricky. Seems like Olas will have a uh, will have a will have a great start actually. Let's go back to Bits as his start is not as good as the others. Uh, we, then we see Olas dropping down though, so uh, he made a little. A, a minor mistake dropping down in speed not, uh, it's not too good uh, we see that Jimmy is in the lead Angelo and Bits are just behind Ola still at 4th place the top is very very close though uh, Angelo is still on the lead not, now got overtaken by Jimmy from Bad Boys he has to take first if he wants to force the draw and uh, of course D2v2 is played to 5 because of the many draws that can happen coming up to the end. Jimmy seems to take first place. So uh, this will not be a draw because Olas will overtake Bits in the end. And uh, that means that this round will go to bad boys. So uh, the first round will go to team bad boys. Olas overtaking my most bitch in the end. Pretty unfortunate, but uh, it happens. So as I said, the the two first two will be played to five points because of the many mistakes that can happen. And look at Olas, oh, with a no drift at the start. I've never seen that be, never seen that before on this map, if I'm honest. So he's once again behind the first three players. Now again, Jimmy is in the lead. Oh, Angelo with a full stop pick. So once again, this round now is uh, in favor of bad boys. But uh, of course, we still have Bits, who is at first place at the moment. 
If he can keep this up, this will still be a draw for... Well, not a draw for, of course. We see that uh, we see that Olas has made a little mistake there. Bits uh, seems to take seems to take first place and force a draw. But Jimmy coming back with a lot of speed, he will overtake Bits in the end. Who will take it? Oh, it's gonna be Jimmy. Jimmy is overtaking Bits in the end. What was that? Six thousands difference. What was that speed by Jimmy? What was that speed by Jimmy? What happened to Bits? Wow, six thousands of a second's difference. Man, 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 that should never happen. What did Bits do in the round? He was in the lead so nicely. So nicely in the lead and then he just throws it in the end. That's so unfortunate for, for Mysterious Monkeys there. They should have taken that round. They should have taken it. See that uh, in the next round, Angelo is falling a little bit behind. Not the best landing there. Not the most smooth landing. Jimmy is falling behind as well. So uh, now the round is in favor of Mysterious Monkeys. And uh, as we see, Ola's dropping down as well, clipping the wall in the jump. And Angelo, oh, not the best line. A lot of mistakes in this round. We see the only survivor is once again Bits. If he can uh, do the finish, good! No, the commentator's curse! Bits once again. But Jimmy is very far behind. Look at Jimmy. This round is very confusing for me. Will Angelo take first? Olas has more speed. But uh, now this round will go. Will go to Mysterious Monkeys. Yes, it will. The round will go to Mysterious Monkeys. A lot of mistakes in this in this submatch so far. It's kind of a uh, not very organized 2v2. The score, please. Uh, it's now 1-0 in the total score. And uh, now Mr. Monkeys is is not in the lead with 2-1. Uh, with uh, now Bad Boys is in the lead. Mr. Monkeys won the 1v1 with a 7-3 score. Into uh, the next round. Bits again in the lead. Angelo again dropping down here a little bit. So he has to do the drop better, but he is overtaking Olas at least. So uh, this round now is in favor for Mysterious Monkeys. Bits once again in a fight with Jimmy. Oh, Olas coming back very strongly. Let's switch to Olas. Oh, he will lose a little bit of speed though. Oh, not a lot of speed for Olas at all. Bits still on the lead. Jimmy just behind. And Angelo behind him. If this goes on this round, we'll go to Mysterious Monkeys. Oh, I think Bits is losing a little bit of speed here. Let's switch to Jimmy. Now this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys once again. They they tied it up with a 2-2 score. So uh, it's a 2-2 right now. Bad Boys was in the league with 2-0. But now uh, Mysterious Monkeys, they tied it up to a 2-2. And so they are back in the fight for the win of the 2v2. Bits! Oh, bits, 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 bits. With a uh, major mistake at the start. Not good at all. See the Jimmy and Olas both are in the lead. Angelo, uh... Angelo starting the hunt for that first place. But, uh... Ah... Oh, Olas and Jimmy already having a uh, quite nice lead over Angelo. Angelo not with the best line here either. He needs to build up as much speed as possible. Jimmy overtaking that first place of his teammates. Oh, Angelo. Oh, I thought he was going to clip the wall there. But, uh, oh, Olas dropping down. Angelo overtook one. Where's Bits? Can he overtake Olas? He is also overtook Olas. Oh, but then gets a transition bug. Switch to Angelo. Can he overtake Jimmy? No, he cannot. And this round will go to Bad Boys. Very unfortunate transition for Bits. Losing uh, speed. And, uh, and of course that mistake in the start as well. So uh, Bad Boys in the lead. With 3-2 right now into round number 6. There, are, there have been no draw so far. Which kind of surprises me actually. But uh, they may still start happening of course. Bits in the lead, Jimmy and Olas at 2nd and 3rd. 
Angelo overtaking Jimmy. Jimmy is uh, behind Angelo. Angelo with a very inside line. Catching up to the other two players. Which are Bits and Olas. Olas with... Uh, oh, uh, Angelo with a very weird angle. Uh, he's building up a lot of speed though. But uh, he dropped down. Far down to third place. Bits. Bits with Bits clipping the wall. This seems to be an amazing round for Bad Boys once again. Oh, Jimmy with a transition bug right now. And Bits can overtake him. Angelo, no crashing in the end. And uh, uh, Bits also crashing. Man, this end seems to be extremely hard. And uh, once again, this round will go to Bad Boys. Again, unfortunate mistakes from the guys of Mysterious Monkeys in the end. They really have to step up their gameplay in the end. Especially in the end. But now, uh... Bad Boys is at map point. That means they can tie up the score. Uh, I don't think uh, Mr. Smokies is very happy with this result so far. Of course, they won the one for one, but... Uh oh, bits, 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 bits. Once again, with a bad start. I think this is the second round or the third round in a row right now. Not sure. Angelo uh, seems to... Stay close to the bad boys players. Oles with a lot of speed into the jump. Oh, Angelo not with the best. Not with the best Ramstein. Ramstein transition there. But, uh, he is collecting a lot of speed though. In that kind of a little stretch. Jimmy with a losing grip. But uh, somehow he, he keeps his speed. And uh, he stays at first uh, at second place. Angelo with a ton of speed. Overtaking them both. Whoa, Angelo up to first place in one turn and he saves the round for Mysterious Monkeys. Whoa, and Bits also almost overtaking, almost overtaking Oles. What was that, dude? Holy moly. That was such an insane end. Wow. Amazing end from Angelo. That that's what you want to see. That's what you want to see in these kind of rounds. When you have to take first place, but you are at third place. And and you are approaching the end. And just as I talk about Angelo, he crashes the commentator's curse. But you have to make sure you take that first place when you have to. And, and Angelo, he, he executed it perfectly in the previous rounds. But now it seems uh, the job is up to bitch to take first place. As we look to previous rounds. It, uh, oh! Bits, bits, bits. Clipping the edge of the road. And uh, it seems like this will be a GG for the 2v2. Coming up to the last couple of thirds. Let's switch to Olas. No mistakes from Bad Boys. And uh, this round will go to Bad Boys. And that means this will be a GG for the 2v2. Bad boys taking the 2v2 and they are tying up the score to a 1-1 in the total score. Going up to the 3v3 which I think will be played on the same map if I'm correct. Let's see uh, what map we will play. I think it's the same map. I think it will. Yes, it will be the same map. Uh, let's take a look at the world record once again as we play on the same map again. So the world record is set by Dexter. At first, at fifth, we have Severin. Um, we have Tully at ninth. No idea who that is. Um, we have Harney at 13th. Fro at 17th. And uh, we have Tommy D at 25th. What's the 5 5 map? I'm not completely sure about that. I'm not completely sure. I think it is uh, the same map as the 1v1. But uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think it's the same map as the 1v1. But uh, do not... It's... Alright, oh, it, it is going to be Trash Gram, alright. So it's, uh, it's not the same map as the 1v1. So uh, let's uh, take a look at the lineups once again of both teams for 
All right, the 1v1 is the same as, as the 4v4. All right, all right, all right, all right. That's very nice to know. <laughs> it's very good to know. But uh, let's go through the lineups of both teams for this matchup. For uh, Mysterious Monkeys, we have Dexter Bits Marco joining in as well. We, have, ha we haven't seen him a lot in the playoffs yet. And we have Severin and Harney as well. Both also for Mysterious Monkeys. For Bad Boys, we have Jimmy, Fro, Tommy D and Toddy. But of course, uh, the 3v3 only have three players. And I think Bad Boys have already established their lineup for the, for the 3v3. It seems like, so... Uh, That's nice to see. Mr. Monkeys is still not sure who will play for them in the 3v3. Or maybe it's, it is just mind games. But uh, we'll see after the warm-ups are over who will play for Mr. Monkeys. The thing I like um, about these about these jump finishes is that uh, if you you just have to make sure to to collect the the most amount of speed you can possibly get to just overtake um, the last player for that few couple of hundreds to take that first place to to like secure the round and I really like that about jump finishes but uh, here we go GOHF the 3v3 will start right now same up as the SD2 first two artificial intelligence it is gonna be uh, bad boys versus mysterious monkeys mysterious monkeys they won the 1v1 and uh, bad boys won the 2v2 so uh, the score is 1-1 one is one one right now and uh, it seems like Mysterious Monkeys will have Saffron, Harney and Dexter. A extremely strong lineup. And for bad boys we have Tommy D, Fro and Toddy. Here we go. First round of the 3v3 is starting. Following bad boys. Toddy here. Saffron uh, taking the early lead. Toddy with a, uh, with a Rebstein back. Fro also already... Uh, Dropped down. Oh, no, he did not drop down at all. My bad. I think it was. Yes. Tommy D dropped down a little bit here. A lot of uh, red players in the top. Dexter, Seven, and Ed, and Harney all at first, second, and third. Only Fro is challenging them at the moment, but then he clips the wall hard. Full stopping for Fro. And uh, it seems like this is going to be a, a nice and easy round and clean round for Mysterious Monkeys. Dexter and Severin are actually on amazing times here. To uh, be very close, who will take that first place? Severin uh, with more speed and will overtake Dexter in the end. But uh, very good time by both players. A 59.10 and a 59.15 and a 59.24. So uh, pretty nice times by the Mysterious Monkeys players. It's always nice to see, of course. Into a round number two, following Harney for Mysterious Monkeys. Oh, I think, uh, I think Fro uh, dropped. No, it was not Fro who dropped down. I'm not sure. Oh, it was Dexter actually who dropped down. I thought it was a blue player, but uh, it was a red player. See that, my Mysterious Monkeys, Dexter dropped down. So he has some catching up to do. See that uh, Severin is in the lead together with Tommy D and Harney. Severin having a little lead over both players. Harney also uh, joining up with his teammates. But Tommy D is not out of it at all. Stretching to Tommy D. His teammates are coming back as well. They are coming closer to the Mysterious Monkeys players. And that's Severin with a transition bug. And they will drop down to last place. And even Harney will get overtaken by all Bad Boys players. This will be another ace. But now in the favor of Bad Boys. So uh, they tie up the score to a 1-1. Two aces in a row for both teams. 
Let's see if we will see many, many more aces. I always love to see aces. Even though uh, Mr. Smokey has had, a, such, had such a strong start to this round. They uh, still lost it. Of course, very fortunate for Mr. Smokey. We see that uh, Tommy D is already uh, with 6,600 behind. Harney and Seven are, in, are well in the lead, actually. Already uh, having a pretty nice lead over the other four players. Although Fro uh, is catching up to Harney. Severin is going to first alone. Harney dropping down straight into the wall. Severin is at first. Dexter coming back. Overtaking Tordy. Ready to overtake Fro. Uh, which he will actually. Overtaking Fro for that second place. No transition box for players. Tordy clipping the wall on the left. Let's go to Tordy. Uh, no, I'm, I'm sorry to Severin. We will go over the finish line first with a 59.60, uh, 26, a pretty neat time again for Severin. He is, uh, as he's also first in the player scores actually with 13 points. Harney is actually at loss with eight. So uh, he really, he needs to start playing a little bit better. But of course, we are very early into this 3v3. Only three rounds have been played, so uh, still anything can happen. So we see uh, Harney actually going up in the lead together with Severin and Tommy D. Severin clipping the wall to the left, dropping down. All Bad Boys players are still in it. Only Harney is uh, challenging them. Actually, it's uh, not good for Mr. Smokey so far. Dexter has some catching up to do. Will overtake throw? No, Harney will drop down instead. Again at the same part. And this looks to be another ace for bad boys. Mr. Monkeys uh, really need to make less mistakes in my opinion. Look at the speed of Dexter. Doing the same what Angelo pulled off in the 2v2. Taking over three players in one turn. Oh, but then Fro comes back taking that first place. That would, be, that would have been amazing if Dexter could get that first place. Overtaking three players in one turn. But uh, in the end, Fro still overtook him. And he still took that first place of Dexter. But, uh, but that round would have gone to Bad Boys. Either way, Tommy D straight into the pole with a no drift. It's the second no drift we see on this map. I think uh, Toddy also dropped down a little bit. You see that Tommy D is already 2.3 seconds behind. It's not good at all for bad boys. Let's switch uh, to Harney as he is in the lead together with his teammate Dexter. A lot of speed for Harney here in that jump. It's great to see the amount of speed the, uh, the players will collect in that jump. Oh, Harney uh, losing a little bit of speed here. He was going for the more inside line, but uh, now Fro will actually overtake him. It seems like this round will still go to Mr. Smokies as both Toddy and Tommy D are over one second behind. Tommy D almost nine seconds behind right now. And this uh, will be an ace for Mr. Smokies. Yes, it will. A point 16 for Dexter. Great time for him. But, uh, yet another ace. That's the third one we've seen so far in this 3v3 after, after five rounds already. It's, uh, it's insane. So three of the five rounds have been aces. That's uh, that's pretty much extreme in my opinion. We see that uh, Dexter is taking over that first place in the player scores with 23 points. He's four points ahead of Fro, who is at second. Seven at third with 17. 16 points fourth. Tommy D at fourth. Harney at fifth, and Cody at sixth with 14. Harney now uh, actually in the lead together with Severin. Oh, he's actually collecting a lot of speed, a little bit too much. Not able to make the jump good. And uh, because of that, will drop down to last place. Over one second behind already. But uh, this is very close between the other five players. Throw in the lead. Toddy and Tommy D just behind. Severin going too wide and clipping the wall on the right side. Well, Dexter put it off once again, taking first place in the last couple of turns. He will overtake Fro, but Fro will collect more speed. And will he take overtake Dexter? Yes, he will. A uh, 
59.20 and a 59.21. Pretty good times from both players. But uh, this round will go to will go to bad boys. So a pretty pretty damn close 3 v 3 so far. A ton of mistakes as well from from both teams. If uh, if I take a look at the players itself, then uh, Mr. Smokies actually will have to win this 3v3 uh, because they have the better players and more experienced players as well. But uh, now we see Severin the clipping the wall, clipping the the road on the left side a few seconds ago, which made him drop down to last place. Harney uh, still in the lead together with his teammate Dexter. Tommy D clipping the wall on the right. And I think Fro dropped down as well. Even Severn can overtake him. Yeah, he dropped down a lot. So uh, this round should go to Mysterious Monkeys. Bad boys. Toddy is overtaking Harney though. At an uh, insane amount of speed. That turn though. That's... Oh man. If you collect the, the, right, uh, the right amount of speed... Then you can overtake so many players. But uh, this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys. And they uh, will once again take the lead with a 4-3 right now. Fro not even able to finish any he, as he's lying on his back. So uh, it's pretty unfortunate for him. It's, uh, Dexter will now extend his lead in the player's course. He's still at first with 34 points. Fro still at second though with 25 points. See that Hardy and Severin are second to last and last in the player scores. But uh, between third, fourth, fifth and sixth, it's very close. Only three points of a difference between those four positions. Really, uh, Dexter is the only one who is coming out uh, as the best player in this, in this 3v3 matchup so far. He's been playing the best of... He has been playing the best out of all six players. But uh, as we already are half halfway through the round. Toddy uh, is at first place. Harney is uh, in the fight with Tommy D. Both Severin and Dexter crashing in the same turn. And uh, this round will go to bad boys I think. It will not be ace this time. But uh, it's, again they are tying up the score. 4-4 in the favor of no one at the moment. As we see Fro coming closer to that first place in the in the place course right now. Severn kind of a dropping down in the place course. He's now three points behind second to last place. So uh, he really has to step up his gameplay to to collect the, the uh, a, a lot of points for his team but now again he's he's he is already 2.2 seconds behind also throw drop down just a little bit Dexter is at first Toddy and Tommy D are just behind him Toddy with a great speed having a nice angle for this for this next turn as well going very inside but Dexter will build up a little bit more speed there oh clipping the clipping the road on the right Oh, losing a little bit of ground to Toddy. As he is getting closer. Will he, will he collect a lot of speed? No, he will not. But his teammate will. Dexter still on the lead. Tommy D and Toddy coming closer to Dexter. Dexter losing it in the end. Yes. He will lose it in the end. And Tommy D overtaking him. That was what I was talking about. Uh, I like these jump finishes so much. And for once, Bad Boys is in the lead in this 3v3. Taking up the score to a 5-4. This is looking grim for Mysterious Monkeys. They really have to step up their game. If they want to win this 3v3. They should win this 3v3 on paper. Dexter once again dropping down. Well, not, not really once again. Because he, he has been doing great in this 3v3 so far. Uh, the score is right now 1-1. In the total score. And now uh, Mr... Uh, Mr uh, Bad Boys is in the lead with 5-4 in the 3v3. Seems like uh, Severn is in the, in the lead. Haven't seen that too often in this 3v3 yet. Together with Toddy. Oh, very risky line for Severn. But it pays off. 
Having a uh, pretty damn good lead over Toddy right now. Going for the wide line as well to build up as much speed as possible. Oh, Toddy coming closer to 7 7 with a transition slowdown. Overtaking at first place. But Harney and Dexter are just behind 7. So this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys. Tying up the score once again. 5 5. Um, the what if one was played by Dexter and don't know who played for Bad Boys anymore. I kind of forgot. The two v two was played by Angelo and by Bits against Fro and um, I think it was Jimmy. And now the three v three is is being played by Fro, Toddy, Tommy D against Severn Dexter and Harney. So it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a pretty damn close review through so far. As we see uh, Dexter uh, dropping down to last place, Severn to second to last. Dexter on uh, half a second behind already. Half a second behind first. But, uh, Fro is keeping that first place. He's on a uh, pretty good. On a pretty good face right now. His teammate is coming. Is, is trying to overtake him, but. Uh, it won't make a difference. Seven with an ins insane amount of speed here. Oh, Seven. Let's switch to Seven. Will we overtake first place? Yes, he will. Will that make any difference for the score? Where's Dexter? Where's Dexter? He will have to go for the safe finish. Will it make a difference? No, it will not. Bad Boys will take this round and go up to a 6 5 score and going up to a map point, actually. Oh yeah, wait. It, it I think was it think it was Oles and Jimmy. I thought it was Fro as well. Following Harney in this last round potentially of the three v three, Mister Smokies will have to win this round if they want to force it to tennis mode on the three v three. Harney dropping down to last place though, not the best drop for him. Dexter is at first, with a uh, pretty damn good lead over Fro right now. Severin uh, and Harney fighting to get to that second and third place, which they will, which they will! Dexter! Full stopping for Dexter. He's completely out of this round, now it's up to Dexter. Uh, it is up to Severin and Harney. To keep that first and second place. Fro is at second. This does not look good for Mysterious Monkeys at all. Horny with good speed. Oh, but he has to go outside. Paul overtaking Tony. At least Fro taking first place. And this round will go to Bad Boys. I'm very sure. Yes, this round will go to Bad Boys. And because of that, Bad Boys will take the lead in this match with a 3-1 score. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I did not expect this at all to happen once again. Mysterious Monk is not performing their best as they should. But of course the match is not over yet. If uh, the next sub-match is won by Mysterious Monkeys, then uh, the 5v5 will be forced to play. If Bad Boys will win the 4v4, then uh, we will not have to play the 5v5. Because then uh, Bad Boys already won the match with a 5-1 score. But uh, And then uh, the Search Monkeys will not be able to come back from, from that. Because uh, the 5v5 will give you 3 points. Yeah, they are looking very shaky as well. I have uh, no idea what's happening actually. Uh, let's take a look at this map. Haven't, uh, this is a, this is the same map as the one v one. Let's take a look at the records once again. We see at second we have Dexter, at 18th we have Severin, at 27th Harney, and at 28th we have Shark. So uh, let's take a look at the lineups of both teams. We have. Uh, Shark for Mr. Smokies as well as Default, Marco, Dexter and Severin. And for Bad Boys we have Ziggy. He is tuning in. BML, Fro and Toddy. Very curious to see who will play this sub-match for both teams actually. So uh, I'm 
that if bad boys will win if they will win this sub match they will win the match of course i would love to see a 5v5 happen here as well to make it even closer this is probably one of my least favorite maps out of the map pack of five maps of course uh, i think uh, my favorite is uh, the one we played um on the 2v2 and 3v3 i think it's i think it's uh, artificial intelligence that's uh, my favorite map out of the entire map pack i really like it We are waiting for uh, the place to finish the warm-up. No idea if this is the second of the f or the first warm-up. No idea at all. But uh, yeah, let's talk about Mysterious Monkeys. What is happening to Mysterious Monkeys? They look uh, very, very shaky. I think they uh, they really they have to wake up now and they have to start playing. Well, they they have to start playing better. But it seems like uh, the 4 4 will start. It's it's all or it's all or nothing right now for Mysterious Monkeys. They really have to take this sub match. They have to take the 4 4 if they still want to stay in the tournament. If they lose this sub match, then that's it for them. I did not expect it at all. But uh, of course, let's not think about that. Let's focus on the 4 4 right now. It is gonna be bad boys. Versus Mysterious Monkeys, Fro, Toddy, BML, and Ziggy for Bad Boys, and Marco, Dexter, Shark, and Severin for Mysterious Monkeys. Here we go. The 4v4 is starting right now. First round following Bad Boys. Toddy. I hate the name to pronounce. Hateful name to pronounce. Man, man. Nothing, nothing personal, of course. I love the name, but uh, it's very hard to pronounce for me. But it seems like already two plays of Mysterious Monkeys are not having a good start at all. Marco and Severn are already far behind of the rest of the players. Already uh, almost one second behind of first behind first place. Dexter is at first right now. Ziggy at second. Fro at third. At second right now. Shark trying to catch up to Fro and Ziggy. Coming up to the last couple of Third, Dexter is well on the lead. Should not have, should not throw this away at all. Shark trying to build up as much speed as possible for this last stretch. Here we go, overtaking BML at least. Will that be enough? No, not at all. Shark almost forced a draw, but uh, was not enough. And Bad Boys with a great start to the 4v4. And uh, we also see Marco play. We haven't we haven't seen him play a lot in the in the playoffs yet. I think uh, he's really focusing on his um, on his finals exam for school, of course. Of course, they are starting to take place as well. So uh, he did not have uh, a lot of time to play previous matches, but uh, he is here tonight to to help his team out and uh, as we are uh, halfway through into the second row we see Severin at first Fro at second Shark not with a good line at all dropping down a lot Seven still at first but look at these bad boys players they are surrounding the Mysterious Mogus players two bad boys players dropping down uh, if I'm correct about it um, Severin the lead actually BML at second Dexter at third Trying to overtake BML. Oh, Shark trying to overtake Toddy. This round should go to Mysterious Monkeys. Yes, it will. It will be a round for Mysterious Monkeys. So they uh, are on the scoreboard as well. That's nice to see. That both the teams are on the scoreboard. So 1-1 uh, one, one right now. Bad boys versus Mysterious Monkeys. This submatch will tell. If Mysterious Monkeys will be eliminated or if they still have a chance and maybe win the 5v5. If they will win this submatch, the 5v5 will be forced. Then that's the decider map. Shark taking the early lead. Uh, Severin and Toddy still close to him. 
Tony with great speed. Severn as well. Taking over the first place of Shark. With Dexter. Not with the best line. Not with the best line. Oh, not with the best line at all. Dropping down a lot. Let's go to Marco. The guy from the Netherlands. So a yeah, pretty damn good player, of course. Was in uh, was in a trial for team Dignitas, but uh, unfortunately he did not make the trial. Seems like uh, Severn and Shark are in first second right now. Ziggy and Tony are at second and third. Marco, what are you doing? Oh, oh. but uh, he still finishes in front of BML, and because of that. Mysterious Mongoose will take the round. Very, very risky line for Marco there. Oh, that could have been uh, a draw. Man, and man. But the Mysterious Monkeys taking the lead in this 4v4. That's great to see for them. Of course, uh, they want to win this cup match, as I said before as well. If they will not win this one, then they will be eliminated. Shark taking the lead with Toddy, Dexter and Severin. Toddy with a uh, better line than Shark. Oh, Shark taking over the first place though. Shark taking over the first place. Severin and Dexter and Shark both with great lines there. It's BML showing up there as well. Throw as well. Oh, BML clipping the wall on the left side. And this looks to be a very consistent route for Mr. Monkeys. Only Marco... Drop down for Mysterious Monkeys. Uh, look at Severin, Dexter and Shark. This is a uh, amazing thing to see. Three players of one team finishing with great times as well. 101s have been driven here. 101.95 for Dexter and a 101.98 for Shark. Mysterious Monkeys going up to a to a uh, to a 3-1 lead. Uh, they are building up their lead more and more. Of course, they want to win this. Dexter taking over the first place of Severin. Of course, it doesn't really matter because he is his teammate. But uh, he does have a nice lead over all the other players, though. He's on a great time. Severin with a uh, incredible line there. Collecting a lot of speed. BML. Oh, Toddy with the transition buck. Oh, Marco clipping the wall. Let's go to Ziggy. As I do not have a hotkey for him. He's in a fight with Shark. Shark uh, ooh, driving over the quarter pipe. Losing a little bit of speed. See that BML is actually getting a no drift. Dexter as well. And I think Shark as well. No, Shark did not have a no drift. Two people in the same turn getting no drift. Chevron will take first place. And this round will again go to Mysterious Monkeys. Mysterious Monkeys in the lead with 4 1 right now. Looks very, very nice for Mysterious Monkeys so far in this 4v4. Looking great for them. And then you kind of a shaky start, but uh, now they're up to a 4 1 score. But of course. Uh, Bad boys can still come back from this. Oh, BML dropping down in the start. Living the wall on the left. Not good for bad boys. He played uh, an, a pretty good 1v1 against Dexter. Fortunately, he lost with a 7-3 score. Shark in the lead right now, though. Seven at second. Throw at third. Oh, throw not with a good line at all. Three players of Mysterious Monkeys at first, second and third. Shark is leading. Severn at second. Dexter with a no drift. Dropping down to fifth or sixth place. Shark with a uh, amazing lead actually over all the other players. A little, a, a, a lot of big gaps between these players. Ziggy at third. Trying to get closer to Severn. But uh, doesn't seem like that will happen. A Shark taking first with a 101.88. Crazy time. Oh yeah, of course, and the 4 4 will, will be also played to 5. I keep forgetting that. And because of this round, Mysterious Monkeys already won the 4 v 4 I keep forgetting that the 4 v 4 is also played to 5. Man, 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 I should not forget that. I should not forget that. 
But now the score is 3-3 in the total score, of course. So now the 5v5 will be played. I keep forgetting, man. I keep forgetting that the 4v4 is played to 5 as well. But now uh, it's going to be all or nothing for both teams. Of course, uh, on the paper, I think Mysterious Monkey should win this match. But uh, bad boys have proven to be a pretty good opponent for them. I don't think uh, Mysterious Monkey it is at their best though. It's a uh, 3-3. Three, three. The 5v5 will be played to decide who will who will take the match and move on in the loser brackets. Also, uh, this map will be uh, the 5v5 will be played on Trextagram. A pretty wet system. Yeah, I agree as well. It's not uh, really something we are used to see though. So. Uh, I kind of like it as well. Something new in into the scene, but uh, we just have to get used to it, I think. But, uh, let's take a look at the map Trackstagram, made by CVRK and Zert. Let's take a look at the online records. We see that Toddy is at fifth with a 49.188. We see that. Dexter is at 6th, Jimmy at 7th, Severn at 12th, Sissy Man, oh of course he is not for Mysterious Mongoose of course, he's playing for uh, TG in the playoffs, fortunate I think uh, TG already got knocked out for uh, in the previous week against MCON, it's, uh, it's kind of unfortunate, we see a shark at 28, nice crush, nice Nice bark though from Toddy. We will, uh, we will see that happening a lot, I think, uh, in the match as well. So let's take a look at the lineup for both teams. Uh, so far, oh, it seems like uh, both teams have already established their lineups. See, that's gonna be Fro, Toddy, Ziggy, Jimmy, and Tommy D for bad boys, and it's gonna be Shark. Can Sealy, Dexter, Severin, and Harney for Mysterious Monkeys. Now, this Can Sealy dude, he's only 15 years old and he's and he's like he is already playing for such a good team. He keeps surprising me with like his performances and and it's just he's amazing me how fast he can play. Keeps surprising me. Uh, seems like uh, this is already the third warm-up, though. Oh, Shark has to go to the to the toilet. Actually, uh, I don't think he's play. Oh, all right, he's already playing, so he's so he's back. Shark had to go to the to the to the toilet. That happens as well. Of course, let's take a uh, overview of this map. Also, one of my favorite maps out of the five maps out of the map pack. Really like the end as well here. Uh, this jump into the finish you can jump against this kind of pole let's see uh, who will do it let's take a nice angle oh they are not doing it you can jump against this pole and you can save uh, I th think Harney did it you can save a few hundreds if you if you manage to do that kind of a trick I think so uh, it's pretty good to see it, it's good. and it seems like uh, the 5-5 five five will start right now GLHF to all the players it's gonna be uh, the decider map for this loser bracket map mysterious monkeys won the 1v1 then uh, bad boys won the 2v2 and the 3v3 and then mysterious monkeys won the 4v4 convincingly with a 5-1 score and now the 5v5 will start it will be played to 7 hope to see uh, an amazing long contenders mode of course it's gonna be very intense then, but uh, we may not see that. I I am hoping for it. Let's see uh, what this 5v5 will bring us. It's gonna be bad boys versus mysterious monkeys. It is 3-3 in the total score right now. The side of the map 5v5. Let's see who will win. Uh, who will win this map? Following Harney as he gets a Ramstein bug at the start and already falling down to a last place. 
switch to Cancelli. She is at fifth place, just ahead of Fro. Oh, Cancelli clipping the pause already. Two guys of Mysterious Monkeys have dropped down. You see that Dexter is in the lead. He played the one v one against a new era previous week. He also won it with a 7-4 score from Greg Fro dropping down in the dirt section. Now Severin overtaking that first place. But uh, it seems like Ziggy and Tommy D and Toddy are third, fourth, and fifth. And Jimmy at sixth. And this round will go to Bug. It's gonna be a draw. I was pretty sure it was going to go to Bad Boys. But uh, it seems like uh, draws are also possible in a 5v5. You don't see that happen too often, I think. Let's plop out the... Oh, it seems like uh, the points are wrong. Don't know what's happening. Don't know what's happening. The points are wrong. No idea what's happening. It seems like... Uh, Server is not giving the correct amount of points to the players. There's no draw in the 5 5. No, I, I was already pretty surprised about that uh, it was like able to happen. Seems like uh, I was uh, not wrong. Seems like the points are not correct after all. Let's see if the points are correct now. A little bit of a delay here. It's gonna be a restart for the 5v5. So, uh, kind of a. Uh, Miss malfunction of the server, I think. Right, so I think uh, the players are gonna drive one round to test this course to see if everything is correct and settle to go. I am getting pretty tired as well. I haven't had any hitter at all just yet. So uh, I am gonna feed myself after this 5 for 5 is over. I'm gonna eat a lot. I'm very, very hungry. I'm starting to get very, very tired. It's been a pretty busy week, but uh, I don't know if, if this is live. But if it is live, then uh, we see that Sovereign is in lead together with Kensili, Harney, and Fro. Ziggy is uh, also up there. Oh, can see the uh, clipping the pole there. Oh, then Dexter dropping down as well. Severin uh, with a little bit weird of a bump there. Hani is coming closer to him. See that uh, Ziggy is going up to third. Shark still at fifth trying to overtake Jimmy. Oh, Shark dropping down. And this round uh, will go to Bad Boys, I think. No, the points are still not correct. Hmm. Not really sure what's happening here. The server seems... Uh, seems to be uh, weird. <laughs> um, you might ask yourself, what is the problem with the points? Well, the first place gets 8 points instead of 10. And, uh, 8 should go from 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 if I'm correct. Yes, I am correct about it. Um, so I'm not really sure what's going on. Haven't We haven't had this problem before on this server, so it, uh, it's kind of weird, I think, that this happens. So uh, we're gonna play another round to test. 
Trichomania is going to calculate if uh, this course was correct. Helis is going to use his brain to uh, and probably use his calculator as well to set the correct points. Hopefully, he will listen to our prayers and set the points correct. And if not, uh, I'm not sure uh, what we will do about it. But uh, seems to have a little bit of delay here. So if you're, if you just, if you just tuned into the match, it's uh, the loser bracket match between Bad Boys and Mr. Smokies. It's uh, 3 to 3 right now in the, in the total score. We are now playing the decider map of this match. It's going to be the 5v5. Uh, we're having a little bit of a delay right now because the server is doing uh, some weird things with the points the players are getting after each end of a round. After finishing first, second or third. We are now doing some rounds to test if the points are correct. And if not, uh, the, the delay will be even more. So uh, let's see. Nope, still not correct. First place still gets eight points. It's kind of weird that uh, that the server is doing this. Haven't had this problem before, so uh, it's kind of weird. We might have to change servers, it seems. Um, this will also affect the focus of the players, of course. Oh, uh, let's switch to this uh, thing very quickly. Um, wait, 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 what's happening? I have no idea. I'm asking for the password here. Sorry about this delay. Alright, there we go. If uh, the if the game will let me to join the server, it will be great. Yes, there we go. Alright. Alright, there we are. The, the server of bad boys, I think. Hopefully, uh, the server will have the correct amount of points. It seems like uh, we are playing uh, bad boys versus, versus Team Delta. <laughs> That's not correct, but... Uh, oh, well. It, it happens. It happens, Trickmania sometimes uh, does not feel like uh, does not feel like working out as good as it should. They are throwing us sometimes. But, uh, hopefully, uh, the server change will fix the problem. So again, my apologies for the delay. The. Uh, Hopefully the server will have the correct. Yes, this server has the uh, has the correct uh, has the correct amount of points. And actually, Dexter is setting a great time in the warm up, a 49.36 or rather the round to test the scores. Yeah, uh, 49.36, pretty good. She's gonna. Take this moment and uh, put my link in the description. Seems like the players are getting set up in the in the correct teams. But we blue against red right now, so uh, it's not gonna be Delta against bad boys. So that's uh, that's nice. Seems like the points are correct right now, so I think we are uh, ready to go. So uh, a lot of delay for the five v five, but uh, it's about to start right now.
pretty long match in my opinion already. We already uh, playing for almost one and a half hour. It's 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 absolutely insane. But uh, here we go, Geo HF. Two other players gonna be bad boys versus mysterious monkeys in the five v five. The score is 3-3 at the moment. This map will decide who will get eliminated and who will go through in the loser brackets. And um, yeah, just they will go further in, into the tournament. All right, let's see who will take the 5v5. First round, Bad Boys versus Mysterious Monkeys. It's going to be Jimmy, Fro, Ziggy, Tommy D versus Dexter, Harney, Kansili, Shark, and Severin. Here we go, first round of the 5v5 following Shark. This map was the 1v1 for last week, but now it's a 5v5. Gee, that Severin is having a uh, pretty nice start. Shark as well. Going up in the lead actually, overtaking his teammates. An insane amount of speed as well. But uh, this looks very, very close. Oh, I think Severin dropped down. Oh, Ziggy dropping down as well. Fro dropping down as well. Shark at first, Severin at second. Oh, Tony overtaking two mysterious Morgan's players in the end. But uh, it doesn't really matter. Mysterious Monkeys will take the first round of the 5v5. So a great start for Mysterious Monkeys to this 5v5. To the decider map. Following to the four bad boys. Oh, Arnie with a, a great amount of speed though. Going up in that first place, who dropped down? It was Dexter from Mysterious Monkeys who dropped down hard. Shark at first, Severin at second, not dropping down. Now Toddy is at second. Toddy with a great amount of speed. I think he had to release a lot. Oh, but then there's an awkward line in, into the little dirt section. Shark still at first, Severin and Harney overtaking second and third. Arnie losing a little bit of speed though, drops down to fourth. Shark is seven once again at second of at first a second. And this will be another round for Mysterious Monkeys 2-0 right now for Mysterious Monkeys. Into round number three. Seems like Shark and Severin are first and second in the play scores. Shark at 20 points. He got first two times in a row. Maybe he, so he has a perfect start to the sub match. And uh, Severin is at second with 17 points. Now uh, Shark once again is having a, a great start. Harney actually in the lead. He's popping up. So uh, Shark not in the lead at the moment. Dropping out to fourth. Harney in a fight with Ziggy. Harney is disappearing on the tree in the entire time. Right now he stays on the screen. He's still at first. This round may potentially go to Bad Boys actually. But uh, it's very, very close. I'm still unable to call who will win this round. Shark is still dropped down just a little bit. Jimmy is at, at last place. Far at last place. And I think this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys. Yes, it will go to Mysterious Monkeys. So, uh, Mysterious Monkeys, they are going up to a 3-0 lead over Bad Boys. Oh, man. They must feel the pressure right now. Here, uh, Bad Boys have to step up the game if they want, if, if they still want to, if they still want to take part in the Exos Cup for further matches. Dexter uh, in the lead, where we are used to see him, who dropped down, I think it was, no, I think it was Shark who dropped down. Of, or Severin, at the, it, it was Shark and Severin, Ziggy dropped down a lot as well, 5 seconds behind first place right now. See that Sharni and Tony dropping down as well, a lot of mistakes in the round so far. Dexter at first, Tommy D in the fight with Kensili, Dexter dropping down. Let's switch to, uh, to Tommy D here. Fight with Kensili and he will also take first place. But uh, I think this round will still go to Mysterious Monkeys. Yes, it will. So 4-0 for Mysterious Monkeys so far. They're one step closer to that next round in the loser bracket. One step closer of winning this match against Bad Boys.
following Tommy D in round number five. Severin is, is taking over that first place in the play course of Shark. Shark only collected nine points in the previous two rounds. Not good at all for Shark. He had such a great start with two first places in a row. Someone dropped down for Bad Boys, I think. Thrown that with the best line. Oh, I think Shark dropped down. Oh, so many mistakes. Oh, so many mistakes. It's very chaotic on the screen right now. Jimmy at first with Severin. Can see the Honey just behind. Tommy D with a great amount of speed, but not the best landing. You will lose some ground. Oh, can see it with a no drift. Severin still at first playing great so far in this 5v5. Jimmy at second. Harney will stay at third. Oh, no. Harney, what? Yes. He, um, what? Yes, this round will go to bad boys. So they're up on the scoreboard as well. Great for them, of course. Bad Boys is not out of it at all. Severin at first with 10 points ahead of second place. Which is Tommy D. 41 points for Severin. He's doing an amazing job right now. Playing for his team. We've not seen him in a lot in this match yet. He's not been, he's not been playing the best. But uh, now in this 5-5 he is performing very, very good. 41 points collected so far. This uh, ground is extreme because can see he dropped down a lot though. Over one second behind already. Into the dirt tunnel, clipping the wall to the right as well. Throws even further behind though. Switching to Dexter as he is in the middle of the pack. Severin at first, Jimmy at second, Harney at third. Dexter overtaking Jimmy and going up to first. Severin trying to take the first blade as well, but it's gonna be Dexter. And this round will convincingly go to Mysterious Monkeys. The lead with 5 1 right now. Oh, they are getting closer to the victory. They are getting closer to that victory. They need it so badly. Last week was a pretty disappointing match. Chevron up in the league with 50 points. Collecting 9 points in the previous round. Taking the second place. Amazingly job. Amazing job by Severin so far. Harney as well at 37. As well as Shark it's at 37. Fro is at last with 21 points. Not doing very good for his team at the moment. Following Ziggy, who is not also doing the best for his team so far. But uh, of course, deep pressure is extremely high right now. Ziggy uh, going into the dirt part. Trying to get closer to the first place. Dexter not with a good landing at all. He will lose a lot of ground. He is landing way too much to the right side. This round may potentially go to bad boys. Oh, Severin taking that second place that may be very important. That's very important. And this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys. They are at match point right now. Match point for Mysterious Monkeys. 6-1. I don't see them giving this away. I don't see them doing it. Severin at 59 points. Almost 60 points for him. He's been playing very good. Oh, can see me, my friends. What are you doing? Oh, the pressure is so high for him. And of course, for all the other players as well. Following Severin. Best player in this 5v5. By far getting a transition back from the border, but he saves himself. Harney at first right now. Dropping down a little bit, so. To second. Oh, dropping down even more. Even Severin can overtake him. Shark clipping the wall on the left side. He went too close. Went too inside. And now Jimmy, Tommy D, Ziggy and Tordi are taking advantage of that. Even Fro is up there as well. And three plays of Mysterious Monkeys. Dropped down a lot already. And, uh, oh, pff, Harney uh, dropping down a lot as well. And this round will convincingly go to Bad Boys. A very good route for Bad Boys. A 34-21 round score. <laughs> pretty, pretty good round for uh, for bad boys. Following Severin once again. Still Smokey Severin. As he takes a uh, first place in the start. Not a great start for Severin. He's been, uh, he's been driving so, so, so good. I, sorry that, sorry that I keep telling it, but uh, he is really amazing me right now. How 
fast he is driving for his team. Can see he once again drop down. Yeah, oh man, that's not good for Mr. Smokies at all. We see that Dexter and Shark drop down as well. This may potentially be another round for Bad Boys. Severn coming closer to Fro. Fro tries to keep that first place and he also will keep the first place. And yet again, another convincing round for Bad Boys. It's not over yet at all, this. It's not over yet at all. Slowly but surely, Bad Boys are fighting back. Severn with 77 points. Man, that's sick. Dexter at last right now with 34 points. You can see Lee with 40 just ahead of him. Let's follow uh, Tommy D for Bad Boys right now. He has been playing pretty decently for, for his team as well. Oh, Shark. What happened? Oh, no, it was not Shark. It was uh, Dexter who dropped down. Let's see Lee also a little bit behind his behind the first couple of players. Severin dropped down as well. Severin dropped down. That's not good for Mr. Smokies at all. Oh, they are throwing. They are feeling the pressure. Shark and Harney uh, will have to take first second if they want to keep hope for Mr. Smokies in this round. Can see Lee also coming back, overtaking a bad boy player. Jimmy and Jimmy in the lead together with his teammate Toddy. Shark trying to overtake him, but it's not enough. Oh, Toddy! Oh, almost got overtaken by Shark. Man, 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 this is starting to get, this is, this is starting to be a very curious 5v5. Mr. Smokies was in the lead with a 6-1 score. They uh, may are not able to finish this off. That will be a very disappointing. Severn still in the lead with 80 points. He keeps playing good for his team. You can see he uh, also has to step up his game. He's only at 45 points. Oh, shark, shark clipping the pole. Severin falling out of the map. What are you doing? Severin retired. That's not good at all. Dexter clipping the wall. This is not going the right way for Mysterious Monkeys. Bad boys still have hope. As I said, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. Mysterious Monkeys are throwing this 5v5. They are throwing it away. What can see? They're taking first place. But, uh, yeah, it's, he needs his team. Will we see tennis mode? Oh, man, man, man. This is not good for Mysterious Monkeys at all. Will we see tennis mode? Will it happen? Will Bad Boys make the comeback? Both Ziggy and Severn have retired that round, though. This is not good for Mysterious Monkeys at all. Even though Severn is still in the lead in the player's course. He wasn't able to finish the previous round. And he's still 12 points ahead of second place. Oh no! Ken Seeley! Ramstein Buck out of the round. Dead last. Driving straight into the pole. That's so unfortunate. Man. Mysterious Monkeys dropping, dropping down left, right and center. Severn not having the best start to this round as well. A little bit uh, behind the players in front. So this round could still go either way though. Tommy D dropped down for bad boys. I'm unable to call. This round will go to bad boys. I think yes. Convincingly. Convincingly to bad boys. Man, it's gonna be tennis mode, dude. It's gonna be tennis mode. No, no, no. This is not happening, dude. Oh, this is so unfortunate. So fortunate. This is not good at all for Mysterious Monkeys. Oh, and uh, the limit is still set to 7 points. So uh, they have to remove that. Yeah, dude. Bad Boys is coming back, dude. They are coming back. They were behind with 6-1. But look at this. It's going to be 6-6 right now. Oh my god, this is gonna be so scary for Mysterious Monkeys. They're, oh my god. They're on the edge of being eliminated. But of course, the same, the same goes for Bad Boys. They are both on the edge of elimination right now. Mysterious Monkeys could have, they could have, they, they, they just could have finished it.
They could have finished it, but they did not finish it. They did not finish it. They had the chance to finish it off, but they were unable to do so. They were unable to do so, and, and, and it kind of surprised me that Dexter is not playing as good as he as as he usually is. He's only at 50 points. Oh, shark finish. That's not good. So uh, we need a restart for the. What do you win by that, Marco? There is no tennis mode, you mean? There's no tennis mode at lower bracket. Are you sure about that, dude? I think there is. Uh, because they changed the l limit of the score. So I think there is, though. Not live, not, not live. Alright. What? Why to six? Oh, alright, alright, alright. Alright, so there's no tennis mode, it seems. Um, Alright, I was not aware of that. Thanks once again. I uh, really have to uh, have to read the rules more. Learning point for me. So I guess it's gonna be uh, the last round then. Oh, man, 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 man. One more restart to get to... Uh, to give points to the teams. Again, a, uh, a kind of a weird 5v5, my opinion. First server uh, was not working, and now, uh, now the point limit has to be set to... Alright, then I guess there is no tennis mode then. I hope that uh, the Mysterious Monkeys players are aware of that, so... At least Marco is, but... Uh, don't know about the other players. I think they are, though. So, one round. Alright, it's in the consultation. Uh, final is a... Uh, is a tennis mode. So, here we go. Last round. Oh! Another quick restart. Here we go. End of the warm up, kind of. GOHF to both teams. These both teams are on the edge of being eliminated. Last round of this match is going to start now. It's a 6 6. The, the score says 0 0, but it is 6 6 right now. Here we go. Last round of the. Last round of the match. Here we go. Mysterious Monkeys versus Bad Boys. Let's follow Tommy D into this last round. The pressure is extremely high for both teams. This will be it. What will happen? Will Mysterious Monkeys be eliminated? Or will Tom or, or, <laughs> or will Bad Boys be eliminated of the tournament? Dexter already dropped down for Mysterious Monkeys. Seven at first. Tommy D not with the best angle for this line clipping the wall on the left side this looks great Harney dropping down after Ram Steinberg Shark Severin are in the lead together with Jimmy Cancelli at fourth this looks good for Mysterious Monkey so far but there are more players there are more blue players here oh this is so close who will take this round Shark at first Jimmy trying to overtake the first place Jimmy taking second this round will go to Mysterious Monkeys will win the match! Holy Jesus! Oh my jeez! Oh man! I am shaking right now! I am literally shaking right now! Oh my god! Mysterious Monkeys will win the match! G! Fucking G! Man.